More than 3 million Americans are living with hepatitis, but there is a cure. In tonight's Wear the Gown, Eyewitness News reporter Jeremy Baker explains which group has a higher chance of having this life-threatening disease. Hepatitis C is a blood-borne infection. It can be transmitted through sex, through use of contaminated needles. Clarissa Carvalho, a family nurse practitioner with University Health System, says there is no vaccine for the disease, but a blood test for the illness could save your life. If it goes uh, untreated, uh, you can have hepatocellular carcinoma, which is uh, liver cancer. You can have cirrhosis of the liver, which is the liver actually failing to work. Some of the symptoms of hepatitis C include bleeding and bruising easily, fatigue, itchy skin and yellow discoloration of the skin, dark colored urine, fluid buildup in the abdomen and swelling of the legs, and confusion or drowsiness. Sometimes you can have absolutely no symptoms. You may not even know you have hepatitis C unless you're uh, checked for it. If you are a baby boomer, meaning you were born between the years 1945 and 1965, you have a five times greater chance of having hepatitis C. In fact, three out of every four people with hepatitis C were born during those two decades. After 1965, you know, we were using more disposable needles. We were more stringent with universal precautions for infection control. If you test positive for hepatitis C, to cure it, all you have to do is take one pill a day for a maximum of 12 weeks. Most patients say it's just like taking any other medication. Jeremy Baker, Ken's 5 Eyewitness News. For more information about family health, call 210-358. 3045. You can also find the rest of Wear the Gown stories. Just head over to wearthegown.com.